What's up, you guys? So I'm back with another video. This is a lace front wig. This is with the familiar company. I'm pretty sure you guys have all heard about Ali Pearl. They have here on AliExpress. They have their own website. You know, they, they sell affordable hair. Bundle hair, wigs, you know, you name it. Closures, lace frontals. They will sell it to you. So this is probably like about my sixth time working with them. This time around, I did get this back at the end of July, and it is a deep wave 13 by 6, 18 inch lace frontal virgin human hair. And right now when I'm looking at their website, it does go up to 30 inches. So if you girls want hair down to your ankles, then you can definitely get it from Ali Pearl. But the one that I'm showing you is a unit that is $174. I do believe it's either 150 or 180%, and like I said, it's 18 inches, and it's a deep weight. Prior to this video, you guys already know how I'll be bleaching the knots. I'll pre-pluck it, and I did even spray in some of this spray here, which is by the Tailored Crowns. This is the one that I used on this particular wig, because I do have another brand that I've been using a lot lately, which is Wig Extensions, but I did spray the... Um, Taylor Crown's one on the unit, and in the color I used was, I think it was either almond or caramel, I can't really remember, but I will definitely link their information below. I did sew an elastic band in this unit. Um, it does come with combs and an adjustable strap too. The one thing that I'd be like irritated with lace frontals, and it's not just, it's not just this company, it's like, I like a lot of them. You know how you, you can put your hair up in a bun if you want to with a lace frontal. But sometimes that little flap, you see the little flap right here, flappity flap. It gets in the way, you know what I mean? Because it's just like hanging here like, why? So I told you guys before that I wanted to cut them off. I'm just going to cut them off. Because if you cut them off, then, you know, you'll have it straight across, which will be somewhat like a 360, you know what I'm saying? It'll be a lot easier to put on. But when you cut it off, you're, you're going to have to follow the track. So don't just start cutting, okay? I'm going to try it out on this wig right here. I'm going to cut it off, all right? If I destroy it, then I just destroy it. But I'm pretty sure I want it. Like I said, I did get this unit back in July. It was like the end of July. And, you know, I wasn't able to record any videos for a minute. Um, it wasn't that I wasn't able to, I just was not going to, um, you know, I was in the grieving process, which I still am. And I want to point out the fact today that I am wearing my son's shirt. This is not one of his shirts that he just wears. This is one that was created for him, for a lot of people, um, during his services, his celebration of life services. So if I told you guys in the past, he does have a clothing brand called Organized Chaos. One of the young people that were collaborating with him designed this shirt here. And this one is not Organized Chaos. It is Organizer of Chaos. So I just wanted to shout him out up in heaven and let him know how much I love him. And that, you know, I'm thinking of him and I'm wearing his shirt. And I think they did an amazing job with designing the shirt. They even put in his signature from his driver's license. And on Instagram, he was called Jalen the God. I just wanted to wear it because I wanted to honor him like I do every day. So I just wanted to put that out there in case anyone is like, where'd you get your shirt? What's on your shirt? It is my son. And um, I will be doing an update video on how I've been getting through this. You know, you guys don't see me, but on the camera and, you know, a lot of people have sent me messages. Some people have sent me messages that were kind of like negative to me. I like, I think they are negative because you don't really know what I'm going through to say to me that I shouldn't be doing videos right now. You, you don't, you know what I'm saying? You don't live my life. You don't know really, you don't know what I'm going through. Just because you see me here doesn't mean that I'm not hurt. And I really don't need to explain that to anybody. Okay, but I will be doing an update video because there are some, um, there is one particular website that I'm not too fond about and it's called Makeup Alley and I will have and have already contacted them along with uh, my attorneys. Um, so I will be um, updating you guys really soon. You know, I really shouldn't have to be um, updating, not even that, it's not that, because I know you guys are concerned, but I really shouldn't have to go through 
extra stuff that I don't need to. And I really didn't want to say the word stuff, but I'm trying to keep this, you know, curse word friendly. So anyway, um, we're going to get into this video. I'm about to cut this off. So, you know, we're going to see how I cut off the flap. Here goes the flap. I cut the flap off my wig. I cut the flap off my lace front wig. So this is the tail part in the back. Okay. This is the tail part in the back. It didn't take away from the wig. The comb is still here, but I just get tired of it sitting right here and just flapping, especially when I want to put it up in the ponytail. I mean, like, you could just still keep this. I don't know what you want to do. You might want to, like, you could, like, glue this. We could have, like, a bang with this, hunties, okay? This will be, like, a bang. Let's, like, swoop it. We can take this. We can glue it here. We could just, like... You know, something like that. I'm just saying, I, I, I definitely wouldn't throw this away. And it came off really easy. You know, it's just the flat part. I don't think this is really needed. So we just gonna, you know, we gonna. Now it's more like a 360 to me. All right. There's no, there's no lace right here, but I don't need that to glue down. All right, you guys, let's try it out. All right, all right, all right, you guys. So this is the Ali Pearl 13 by 6 lace front. And it is 180% density. The length that I have is 18 inches. And it is a medium cap with Swiss lace. So that is the one reason why it just bleached so seamlessly and is just so transparent like. It has really nice lace. This unit will run $181 on their website. There are different densities to choose from. There is 150 and I do believe there is also 200. But this 180 is more than enough, so I do believe if you don't like that much density, then 150 will just suit you just fine, and the price will definitely go down. So as for this part right here, after cutting off the lace, I'm just going to customize the wig so that way it will lay flatter to my head instead of having like the ear tabs flapping over my ear or tucked behind my ear. I'm just going to part right above my ear, and I'm just going to cut off that extra ear tab piece. And then I'm just going to repeat that on the opposite side. And make sure that you part directly above your ear. You don't want to cut it too high up, but you want to cut it to where it's directly above your ear. And I'm just gonna make sure to get every little piece of lace so that way it looks as natural as possible. And I'm gonna take my rat tail comb and I'm gonna create some sideburn hairs. But before doing that, I did notice a small piece of lace. And even though this wouldn't have stopped the wig from laying flat, it would have shown. And I wanna make sure that every little piece of lace is not being shown. And along with making sideburn hairs, I'm also going to make like some wispy hairs. To apply and adhere my wig, I'm going to be using the Got To Be Glam Force hairspray. I love this hairspray. It will hold your wig in place for days, especially if you wear a scarf at night. You can either spray it over the lace, on top of the lace as I showed here, or you can spray it underneath. For some reason, to me, it just seems to hold better when I spray it on top of the lace. And I spray in between the parting so that way it's not on the hair. And I just press down with my rat tail comb and I blow dry on cool to medium heat. But if you don't have a blow dryer, you can just spray in small sections at a time and allow it to dry because the product does dry out really quick. And now that the wig has been adhered, I'm gonna take my small scissors and I'm just going to cut and create me some sideburn hairs using my Got To Be uh, Glam Force Gel. And that gel I did put in a jar, which you just see me dip into, and that will only 
help the gel get thicker quicker if that makes any sense it it will oxidize it which will thicken it up making the application process a lot quicker easier and it will allow it to dry faster and now just to swoop those baby hairs or you know wispy hairs i'm going to be using the got to be uh fantastic styling mousse and i'm just going to take my toothbrush and brush down my sideburns along with that i'm just going to sculpt my wispy hairs or baby hairs whatever you want to call them i'm just going to sculpt them this wig looks really nice you guys like look at the lace like for real i bleached it i pre-plucked it i like this swiss lace it is so nice and it's almost transparent and i wish i could remember which color of the tinting spray i used but i do believe it was the lightest color which was caramel because almond was a a little bit too dark for me um i do like the tinting sprays a lot they make life a lot easier so you definitely want to check them out when you get a chance if you're in need of any or you just want to give it a try i like both companies so you know if you want to try the smaller bottles check out wig extensions but both taylor crowns and wig extensions have really great you know tinting spray and that's the final look you guys Finally stop running now With you I found my peace somehow Like go of every thought that was holding me back yeah. I'm in love with you in every way That joy you give me every day Makes me forget that I was troubled before Don't know if I'm dreaming I'm slipping away I Hear your sweet voice, then I see your face I never knew you could love someone like me You climb my tower and you set me free I never, never, never know felt like this before Okay, girls, so let me tell you, you know how to cut the flap off, right? Honey, let me tell you, this is much better in the back, okay? It's like straight across. I could pull out a little bit of my own nape hairs and brush it up and put this thing in a bun. I'm going to worry about that little flappy flap thing. Girl, listen, first of all, now, the, the wig is cute. It's nice, okay? Look, I just brushed some of the little bit of hairs down. Like, I'm not trying to be, like, going too crazy. The back, I like the back without the little flappy things. I don't know what you want to call them, the tails or whatever, but this is what it looks like, okay? This is how it always looks. All I got to do is put a little bobby pin right here and right here, and voila. Much easier to put up in like a ponytail with that little flappy thing going. Customize that flappy thing, okay? Very full, voluptuous curls, okay? I seem to like them better once the, the hair is dry all together because it just looks a lot better to me because um, I like big curly hair but not too big. You know what I'm saying? Like, And then I can't really wet it in all the spots that I want to wet it in, but girl, listen. This wig is very plentiful and full, okay? So you're definitely going to get your money's worth. You got enough parting space in this bad boy, okay? And, you, you know, you might cut, need to customize a little bit. But, you know, I did, okay? I cut off the ear tab some, and I cut off the flappy thing in the back, okay? So, Ali Pearl, you can check them out. I'll definitely link their link information below. Ali Pearl, you can find them on AliExpress. You can find them on their own website. You can probably find them on Instagram, Facebook. I don't know, whatever else. But thank you to them as well as you guys for being so patient and loving and supportive to me and my family. And I just want to tell you guys that I love you guys even more, just as much. I love you guys more. And I just appreciate everything from you guys. So I'm going to just be moving along now to the next video. But thank you guys. All the information will be at the description box below. Oh, oh, oh.